Okay, you guys, so we know Krishan is in labor. She's about four centimeters dilated. Now she went live from her hospital room just to show us everything that's going on at the moment. Now Blueface is not at the hospital with her. I know he was in Miami yesterday. I don't know if he has plans to go up there or not because you know these two are always hot and cold. Now towards the end of this live that I'm getting ready to show you guys, you can hear someone whisper and ask her, has she talked to him? and then all of a sudden the live ends. But go ahead and watch Krishan's live and let me know what you think in the comments. Hi, Dr. Leon wanted me to come in when you're comfortable and check you. Sorry, love, sorry, and, sorry. And That's your tingly. Room. It'll be done in a minute. I'm so is it my coochie? It's in your bladder hole. Bladder hole. So you have a separate hole. <laughs> done i'm just going to clean you out while she's talking and move this stuff out the way okay i don't want to open can i get the blue bonnet yeah my hair fucked up hello here you go Aww. let me get you cleaned up so so oh my god i know it's a lot of things you've never done before so that's the end why i'm put once you go to push, we take it out. But it stays oh. in until you go to push. Okay? Well, do you put one in my butt hole or something? No. Why would we put one in your butt hole? Because my you put one in your urethra? No, if you poop, you yeah. poop. We clean you it up. Poop. What? You cleaned it all out this past day. You said you've been pooping like crazy. Probably gone then. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about poop. We clean up poop. That's okay, you really in my coochie like that. You ain't the only one who's coochie I'm in. Huh? You know how there's cardiologists and they do hearts? Well, we're labor and delivery. We do vaginas. I'm the PTA queen. The pussy queen. I'm scared to move. All right, baby. No, it's, it's done. So how it's big done. is your coochie hole? I mean, like the um, pee hole. It's not big. There's a little flexible tube in it. Oh. How big is it? Let's sit you up a little bit so we can talk to you. It's really small. Like yeah, it's really small. It's sized once she's done talking to you we'll move however you want so when you're comfortable and when you're ready dr leon would like me to check your cervix if there's a bag of water left to break break it break it uh-huh pop it pop it pop it remember i said there can be two sacks right of fluid yep. you are leaking some and then put a monitor in on the inside another tube in the other hole to monitor your contractions from the inside so when you're ready Right now? Oh, yeah, ready. You ready? Yeah, I'm I told ready. you all these things we're trying to do is to help you have this baby. Yeah, all right, let's go. You want right, to ready? Okay. We'll leave her. It's full so, time since you're... So you pop it and then what? I'll show you. She'll show, yeah, she'll show if you. There's... Can I get a mirror or not? Sure. I want to see, see it. Much, though. You're not going to see me break it. You're just uh, going to see, just gonna see your her vagina. your vagina. Are you just going to be my coochie? Yeah. Yeah. So basically, if there's any water left, you see this little tiny little thing right there? Mm -hmm. We just snag the little bag and then the rest of the water will break and then... The Did the baby kick? It's not moving. What? Your baby? Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah, it looks yeah. straight on the monitor. Maybe this great. little tube right here is going to help us monitor your contractions better, okay? Yeah. All right? It'll just be like one cervical exam, but it'll be a lot different this time now that you are got your epidural, okay? Mm-hmm. I'm going to lay you back the same way we just did it, okay? Mm-hmm. Oh, God. So I yeah. love. All right. I want to start pushing already. You can't push yet. Oh, girl. You got some time. Yeah. All right, love. Same thing. Relax out. Oh, no. My coochie. It's okay. You keep saying that. We do this every day. Because you all up in there. We like, want to be all up in there, girl. Like, that's disgusting. <laughs> this is what we do. We help mommies yeah, really. become mommies. And what would you do if you didn't have us? Huh? What would you do if you didn't have us? I'd probably push it on myself. Of course you would, but we're here to help. <laughs> <laughs> Could be a man up in here. True oh, that. for real? Yeah. But there's no, yeah. Hell no. But there's no men, so don't worry about it. Good. You ready? Okay. okay. Try and relax. You're the gonna feel me touch, relax, okay? The more you relax. Oh, oh this is when you pop it. Yeah, uh, but it's going to feel different that you have your epidural. Like when Christine checked you earlier, it's going to feel different. Right, because that hurt. Yeah, but you have, a, you have some pain yeah. relief now. Okay? Am I having a good choice? Um, maybe. It might be. Yeah, I think you are. You ready? Yeah. That's why we're going to use this monitor, though, because that one's not so reliable. This one's going to help us induce you better. Okay. Ready? You ready? Can I touch? Okay, you can touch it. Okay. 
Just, just let me know when you're about to pop it. Oh, I will. I have to get in first. It feels different, right? It just yeah. feels weird, right? I feel like she's fingering me. <laughs> <laughs> I promise you I'm not. All right, relax your leg. Is much bag. As, okay, what was right. her cervix last? Two centimeters? Oh, no. She's like a lot more than that. Look for real? Yeah. Let's go, girl. Yes. I get right out of baby. Oh, wait. Here we go. What's she doing? Oh, you hurt me. Almost done, almost done. Hang in there. Nope. No, she's like four. Good. Four. That's yeah. good stuff. Where I gotta go? Ten. ten. Gotta get to ten. We're almost okay, this done. Is the tube. The tube? Well, how far did that go up in there? Not very far. It okay. goes right next to baby. You're doing good. You're how does she know how to do it? She does this daily. Oh, I do. I've been doing this for a long time, Mama. Okay, I'm done. All well done. So you're like four and a hundred. That's good. How do you know? She's feeling your cervix. So when I go into your vagina, I find, I feel for another kind of hole uh -huh. up inside. And I open my fingers to see how far dilated you are. And it's about four centimeters when I open my fingers, like two fingers, and I can open them. Four and 100% effaced. It's just practice. Oh, so you did this. I've been doing, yeah, I've been a midwife for 11 years. Oh, man. And then a labor nurse before that for 10. I haven't lied to you yet, have I? Then no. I'll be able to take I'm the having off. fun. You having, having fun? fun? <laughs> yeah. This is easier than I thought. So you just popped it? Yeah. What was left of, of it? Yeah. There was some of it was already gone. Yeah. It's like a tight is water it balloon. Blood? It's going to be bloody. Yeah, because your cervix is dilating and your cervix has blood flow to it, so it does. A little bit of bleeding is normal. Yeah. I'm just hooking this monitor up here. This is going to tell us exactly what's going on with your contractions. Kind of like when you, if you brush your teeth too hard and you notice like you sit in the sink and it's pinkish like that. I'm going to see like if that. your pads need to be changed before I move you. Pad. Yeah, I'm going to throw one more pad. Though. Yeah, we put you all puppy pads. No. <laughs> I say you work for that. Oh, so it's moving quick. You're Try and move your butt a little bit. How long I got to stay at the hospital? Okay. After you have the baby? 24 to 48 hours. All right, lift up one more time. Yeah, just one to two days. All right, damn, I have to go down. To Girlfriend, you gotta have the baby first. <laughs> Listen, the I know it's a joke. It's a joke. I know, I know. <laughs> we gotta get you to calm down, though. We keep making your blood pressures go up and down. I know. All right, I'm, I'm all right. right. So 400. Beautiful. The best thing I can do for your labor is Mine's keep too. positioning you while you're in the bed. So, what I wanna do is put you on one of your sides. And we have this ball that's called the peanut ball, and it just sits in between your legs. You usually forget it's there, but it keeps your pelvis at like a better angle to help promote the baby coming down versus you just sitting here doing nothing. All right, let's you want to go that way? Okay, okay. I'm gonna move this. Way. Okay. I'm good, thank you. Because right, his back on this side. If his back's on that side, go this side. Actually, his back is on this side. Oh, it's on this I'm side? pretty sure, yeah. How do you know? Because it's firmer here versus here. You don't really feel anything, which probably means there's like some hands and feet right there. Uh -huh. But it's very firm on this side. So, this so side. Yeah. Nope. The opposite way, basically. So the opposite way we go is to kind of just promote them. I tell people. But I got shit in my coochie, so how oh, many tubes? It's going to be okay. You got I can feel two it. tubes. All right. Hold on. Let me get the ball first. So that can way you make sure they're not tangled huh? Yo. I have to go grab I'm one of the balls, this okay? phone up. All right. Thanks, guys. Like two seconds. Um. Where's the ball? Jesus Christ. I don't want to stay on my back. Can somebody help me? That just felt weird. Um, my water broke when a couple days ago and I didn't know but it was like a slow leak I just thought my pussy was wet this is the peanut ball and you just put it between your legs Okay, but I got already things between my legs. Do you know they put stuff in your coochie? So, she so didn't have a vaginal delivery. It's a little different. Oh. Um, she has a catheter draining her bladder. And then oh, so I can have my... I don't have to have... It's already going. You don't even have to think about it. There's. You want to see it? It's right here. It's pee? It's pee. I'm peeing? You're peeing. It's going to keep going. You don't even have to do anything. That's disgusting. I've had a catheter before when we have surgery. 
You do. Yeah. You get one with a C-section too. All right, love. So what we're going to do is reposition to your left. So first, whoops. What is your your peanut? <laughs> first, put that down for one sec. Move towards me a little bit so we have some room to roll if you can. Just side, like your whole body. Don't roll because I'm going to roll you that way. I just want you to have more room so you don't roll into the side. No, no, no. no. Straight, straight. Just move your whole body this way. Perfect. There you go. My butt is numb. That's okay. Are you alive? Do you need my help? Yeah. You're not. All right. How about maybe if you took the phone off your hand? Lisa. I'm so tired of that damn phone. So sit that down for a second. All right. I just want to remember this day. Perfect. Are you streaming live though? Yeah. So not it's not it. I have a cousin who's like it's one hundred and it's one hundred and seven. No, it's a, it's it's it actually is is one twelve. It's going up. I don't really appreciate it's that. It's over a hundred thousand. What? Oh, you're good. Yeah, but it hurt my stomach. We can. Can I steal that pillow right there behind you? Or am I tripping? Can you watch the cords that's in my coochie? Hold on. It's okay. Listen, listen. It just it just feels un and don't use they that are word. They're all okay. They are all. You're someone's okay. mother. You can't use this that one? word. Just don't want yep. it. They're all perfect. You're somebody's mother. Stop using that word. What am I gonna say? With JJ? Don't just say it between the legs. Okay. Act like you're acting and you're you're acting like boring Lisa. Okay, Lisa. What, how it, what this keeps saying, what would Lisa say? Some some white shit. Does that feel better? <laughs> Does that feel better? Yeah, that's great. All right. So what I'm doing right now is I'm watching your contractions for like the next ten minutes. I'm gonna see what they do. If they are not what we call adequate, then we are gonna up your pitocin and kind of keep you in a more adequate pattern. Okay. I'm just gonna go grab it and have it in the room. That way we can do that. And can you have someone? I'll check on the comp the she, thing. The woman is so mean, and okay. I like I'm talking to her as I nicely will. as I can. Let me you need to be. Was, that's why I told her shut the fuck up. I didn't want people figuring out she's a GVMC. And, oh shoot! Did you turn that down? No, it's okay. It's okay. But if you know, like her sister may come up. Okay. I, I, Let me figure she, it out. Yeah, my sister right won't now, get ghetto. Well, we, yeah, we well, don't I'll want to get, get up in here. I'll be right I'm just saying, me. like, if well, somebody my, disrespectful, yeah, they're going. My husband come back. She's like, the so only person that can come is, back is me. The thing is, if we have to take her off the confidential, mm. no one can. Because All right. Is he talking to you? Is that on mute? I just unmuted it. Well, I won't say his name. You need to tell him to get his homework done. All right. And what do you want me to say to your friend? Do we like her? We like her, right? Yeah. I can't, I can't. So what do you want me to say to her? Yeah. Did you talk to her yet? Yeah, I'm gonna talk to her. All right, you just talk to her. So this is, people are just sitting here and look. Are people watching this? How many people are watching this? Uh, 106,000. To what? Huh? Look, 106K. Right, you over here just talking, yap, 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 and Josh, get your mother. Is Joshua listening? Mm, Josh is on here. 
Hey, so y'all, I think the baby coming quicker than we think. Okay. Uh -huh. 